Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to type A and O in Microsoft Word or other letters not found on the keyboard. Let's say I want to type in just here, but typing this I have to insert A and A is not found on the keyboard. So this is how we do it. We click on insert tab, click on symbol, more symbols, and then you select the symbol a from the list of symbols available i've been recently using the a symbol so i'll just click on a and insert from the recently used symbols if you have not recently used you can scroll in between these available symbols and then select the symbol what if you want to type all in a word let's see i want to type more I'll type the W and then insert or click on the insert tab, click on symbol, more symbols, and then you select or and then you insert it. Okay, see if you want to type A and O in a sentence or paragraph with the letters appearing more than once. This is how we do it. You can replace or substitute A or an O with C, T, Q, V, X, and then Z. I have a full comprehension document here that I typed for this school. I use the letter X in place of A and letter C in place of O because pausing each time when typing to insert A or O will take a lot of time. Click on a blank space on the document and then you go back and use the old process that we used to insert the air and all in a web. Click on insert, click on all, and then a and then you click on all as well. Now to replace the X that we used when we were typing, you click on the home tab. And then you click on replace in the find what type box we are going to find x because i replaced a with x so we are going to find x you type in the x and then we are going to replace it with a so i'll come to the document select the a copy it and then go to the replace with type box and then paste it after doing this, we click on replace all. You can see that all the X's in the document has been successfully changed to A. Now we're going to change the C to O. So let me play this one. We are going to find C. Then we are going to replace it with O. You come back here. You highlight on the all right click on it, copy it, and then paste it in the replace with die box. And then you click on replace all. Now, as you can see, all the all and the ends has been successfully changed. What you need to understand is the English alphabet consists of 26 letters, so you can subtract the alphabets of the language you are typing from the English alphabet and then substitute the remaining English alphabet that will not be needed with the letters that you need but aren't found on the keyboard. So what if your language alphabet comprises of all the English alphabet in addition to other letters? In such a situation, you can substitute numbers with those letters and then use the find and replace option. 